Let us have an honest talk. I praise God for his promises. I praise God for the dreams and the visions that he's given to us. But let's talk about the season in your life. When you've believed, when you've obeyed God, and, and guess what? And look around you and the promises of cricket, nowhere in sight. And what's worse, you feel like God is quiet. Sometimes that can be one of the most frustrating things for a Christian that is sincerely seeking to please God. Instead of things working out, it seems like it's getting worse. This is where most people leave God. You have shared with others God, what God has told you, and now you're pretty much a laughing stock because the promise is not coming to pass. And what's worse, those who are not praying don't even have a relationship with God seems to be prospering. Their dreams are coming true while you suffer. While they mock you saying what God said to you is false. Maybe you heard wrong. You should try something else. You've cried, you've prayed, you've fast, and do everything else that you could do. Girl, you fasted so much there is nothing left in you. You have come to a point where there is nothing left in you. God said to me, that is it. Nothing left in you. In this moment, you can't do nothing but be still. You see, the stillness scares us, but it's in the stillness. It's in the letting go. God says, when you lose your life for my sake, that is when you will find it. Daughter of God or son of God, you might be sitting in your car listening to this, having the last meal you can afford, saying the last prayer you can open your mouth to pray. You might be in your bathroom floor right now crying your last tear that would fall down your face. God will do what he says he will do. The Bible says when you are weak, that is when he is strong. Joseph was forgotten in prison. In his darkest hour, what took years to accomplish in his life took but a moment. God is still in control. And what I feel led to tell you today is be still and know that he is God. I hope this word blesses you. Subscribe for more and share this blessing with someone else.